talking about the spirit of God. Amen. And to worship and praise him and give him glory. You know, some people don't want to come where it's supposed to be at. Praise God. In a place of worship. Amen. To give God what's right and he is. Amen. I look around, you see everybody go everywhere else, but they never want to come in the house. Amen. And you know, we need to come into the inner court of God today. Amen. The more closer you get, the better it gets. Amen. Because he is the answer. Amen. All the way you go get the answer, you got to come to the answer. Amen. Amen. And I thank this morning for the answer in Jesus Christ because truly he is worthy to be praised. He's worthy to give thanks to. Amen. And I just thank God for his presence. Amen. Because I'm telling you, if it wasn't for him, I couldn't make it. Amen. Amen. If it wasn't for him to comfort me, I couldn't make it. Amen. And I thank God this morning for him being my comforter. And then a leader in my life, amen, yeah. the director, amen, who woke me up this morning because I'm breathing the breath of his life, amen. Because yeah, he decided to take his life from me, I'm nothing, amen. amen. And I think once we can grab hold of that revelation, amen, I think a lot of people will respect him more, amen. amen. Well, then, hey, well, here, stay with me, stay with me, Father, stay with me, amen. But I thank God this morning, amen, for those that are here today, amen. That you be blessed in the word that they we're gonna stand on this scripture, Hebrews 11, chapter, verse 1. Amen. Praise God. Then hallelujah. Praise God. Amen. Chapter 11, verse 1. God, thank you. Hallelujah. It said, now faith, now, 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 that word now, now faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. Amen. It's going to come a time now that our faith got to show no stand out now. Amen. You just can't go by I say. Amen. You got to stand on the word of God. And you know, and you, hallelujah. And God is not they seeing where your faith is, who you believe in, what you believe in. Amen. Because hallelujah, life ain't where it was. It ain't easy as it used to be. Amen. Some places you at now, you ain't never been before. Amen. You wonder. Amen. But this is a time that your faith got to show up, stand out. Amen. And stand out and uh, hallelujah, you don't see it, but you believe it. Amen. Amen. Believe that your deliverer is here. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, he is here. Amen. You just got to believe it by faith. Amen. Got to have that faith to keep walking. Amen. Walk on some thin ice and there ain't no ice down, Lena. Amen. Amen. <laughs> hallelujah. They say it there, but you don't see nothing. Amen. But hallelujah. But it's there. Amen. That's where how do I see faith. God, I thank you today for you are God and you change it not. And Father, as we begin to worship you and give you praise and give you glory and give you honor, we ask you, Lord God, to just have your way in the midst of us. And Father, we thank you, Lord God, this morning that our faith is in you. Because you say you are the way, the truth, and the life. And Father, we thank you for life and life more abundant today. And Father, we bind every demonic spirit that tried to come against the service today. We cancel the assignment in the name of Jesus that your people will be blessed and highly favored in you. And Father, well, that faith is in you, Lord God, I ask you, Lord, that the word will come forth today, that they will see within themselves that you have given them the answer if they only believe and trust in you. And Father, today we trust that you are the way and the truth. And Father, as we begin to give you glory and give you praise and give you honor, we ask for you to just have your way. We ask you to, oh God, we adore you. Yes, we Yes, we honor you. We magnify you. Because there is no other God before you. And there are none after you. And we thank you today that you are who you say you are. And I ask you, Lord God, to just have thy way. Yes, God. Yes, God. Open up your heart today to receive from God today. Amen. 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 Oh, Amen. God, did, 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 I see. don't let your circumstances get ahead of God. Amen. 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 Don't let your circumstances be the God before God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Because God said, I can answer it. Hallelujah. You. If you just allow me to come in and do the work. Amen. Amen. And I thank God for the work that he's going to do today. Yes, you are the deliverer. Yes, you are. Yes, yes, you got to get in your mind. He is 
their deliverer. Yes, yes said that did you all see. They just take a moment to worship him. Just begin to thank him. How that did he all say? You know, sometimes you have to thank him. Hallelujah. Before you even get it. Amen. Hallelujah. It's something about worshiping him. Amen. It's what how the earth I say that. Oh God, we wish you for above all God. Hallelujah. I worship you. I thank you, Lord God. Thank you, thank you. Oh my God, we hallelujah. We worship you, Lord God. We worship you above all. Oh yes, Lord God, we worship you. Oh my God, yes, and it is your Oh God, we worship you, Lord. Oh God, we worship you above all. Holy Ghost, have your way. Oh God, yes, Holy Ghost, yes, Holy Ghost, loose yourself in the midst of the heart of your people. Those are worshiping you in spirit and in truth. Oh God, yes, see the God. Oh yes, Lord God, thank you. Because you said the joy of the Lord is our strength. And Father, I thank you for joy coming forth now that they begin to worship you. Begin to thank you, Lord God. God, before we begin, yes, it is even the same. Before we begin to go into fellowship, God, we fellowship and with you first. To worship you and to give you glory and give you honor. And Father, I thank you that you have your way today in the midst of your people. And we want to give you praise and honor today, Lord, as we begin to praise you. Yes, God, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now it's time to give hallelujah fellowship for embrace each other. Amen. It's something about embracing. Amen. You get strength from each other. Amen. You know, that's where the enemy is really destroying us because we don't embrace one another. We don't even, sometimes we don't even talk to each other. Amen. And you for hallelujah. And that's what causes God's power not to be as strong. Amen. Because we have separate ourselves. When you separate from each other, then you separate from God. Amen. Amen. Because hallelujah, the same spirit in me is in you. Amen. amen. Hallelujah. So today, amen, let's empower each other. Amen. Sometimes just a hug. Amen. And embrace it. Help me. Amen. Sometimes it just, hallelujah, look at a person's eyes and a smile helps me. Amen. And see, sometimes we need that. Amen. And so the enemy know that. Amen. And so what he does, he calls somebody to look there, pull away. So when you pull away from me, you might have my healing in your body and you stay away from me. So I'm not getting what I need. Amen. And so that's, hallelujah, the body got to come together. Amen. It got to with love. Love is the strength of each other. Amen. So today, let us get a little hug. Let us get embraced. Hey, ha, 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 see, hey. Oh God, hallelujah. All right, Michelle. Hallelujah. <laughs>
you, Lord. Amen. Because it ain't happening Amen. in the Lord. outside. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my God, because with the flesh, we lust. That's right. But with the spirit, we love. Amen. Amen. It's a difference in lust and love in amen. the spirit. Amen. 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 And today, amen, I thank God today I feel good in the Holy Ghost that I got victory. I look over at somebody. Do you have victory? You have victory. You know what your problem is? You got victory over that problem. Come on, you got get it in your body. It look like I ain't winning, but I'm winning. Yeah, 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 hey, my God. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. I got victory. Amen. Yeah. amen. What's wrong with you today, Prison? Y'all have victory, amen. Oh, <laughs> praise God. God. We thank you, amen. Praise God, amen. It's going to be well, being I guess, said they need to be You got victory over circumstances in your life, amen. No matter what it looked, that's why you said faith is the something that they hope for, evidence that they not seen. But your faith got the victory, amen. I praise God. So today, I'm hallelujah. Put Lula on today. Say they don't have no authority. I don't matter with my sister. I got to have somebody help me out today. Amen. 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 Praise Amen. God. My brother have been with me today. Amen. I got victory. Amen. 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 Oh, God, I thank you. Amen. So I need my cheerleader. Hey, glory. Praise God. Amen. We got victory. Amen. I don't care what it is. You got victory. Amen. 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 Hallelujah.
Ghost though, they came out across over with a shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They shot that they had victory. Yeah, so yeah. I want you to look at your problem. You done crossed over and yeah. said, I got Ooh. victory. Give me the shot. Yeah. 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 Yes, I got victory. You got victory yeah. when you yeah. shot. Don't you know he crawled up? Yes, glory, glory, glory. Lord. That's Thank something that the enemy can't stand noise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank if you, you give it a shot, you'll see that thing crumbling. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I thank God for the crumbling of my hallelujah victory over every circumstance yes. in my yes. life. Amen. 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 He established the thing in my life that no man can take thank from me. Amen. 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 See, we stay too quiet too long. Amen. When you stay quiet, that makes the enemy keep messing with your mind. But when you begin to open your mouth and begin to scream out, right. he can't do nothing but let go of it. Glory. I thank God today I can scream. Amen. 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 When I scream and die, like, oh my God, I'm like, wait up, take that down. Yeah, when you cussing somebody, I ain't just screaming. Yes. 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 When you bad, you gon' cuss me out. Yes. And that's what you ought to do with the enemy. Scream and bust him out. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. I thank God for the busting out today. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You may have your seat. Amen. Amen. Ooh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I learned one thing. The more you lie your flesh to have more control of your spirit, amen, you die daily. Life leaves you. Amen. That's why he said you're in the world, but you're not of the world. Amen. And see, the world, world system calls death to you. Yes. Amen. We work, especially Christians, they work so much in the flesh. And instead of giving life, they give death to you. Amen. We grab things that's not of God. Amen. We need to start turning the loop thing. Amen. And let it go, amen, because can't, you can't change it until God changes it. Amen. I'm learning one thing. Whatever I'm going through is growing me. Amen. Amen. Because if I look at where things going, amen, uh, some people, they even work with your mind, sugar. Yes. I mean, you have not seen. Preachers don't tell you that, but he works with my mind. Amen. I had to cast out a lot of things. Amen. Amen. And to keep my focus on what God planned for my life. Amen. See, I don't have a plan. He has a plan. Amen. And the enemy don't want you to follow the plans of God. Amen. Because you listen to what your flesh and your mind telling you, you lose. And we are losing so many things. And don't really realize, you know, ain't nobody wrong. me. yes, she did. You got yes. wrong. Amen. And, and because your faith didn't stay in the position to see God bring you through to get that. Amen. Amen. Today we're going to talk about faith. I talked about the woman last week. <laughs> this week we're going to talk about thou faith. faith. So you can check where your faith is. <laughs> Amen. So we hallelujah. I thank God because Jesus is looking at your faith. Amen. He ain't looking at your hours. Mm -mm. He's Amen. looking at the thing. Amen. Amen. He's looking at how much do you trust me? How much do you believe me? How much do you love me? How much you embrace me? You know, sometimes we, we want to know who love us. Amen. Who True. care for us. True. And today you're going to see in the word where Jesus is checking your faith. Amen. And he's checking your faith when you see that your faith is he's going to give you encouraging words. Amen. Amen. I thank God for faith today in Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior. Amen. You are glorifying him in the highs. Amen. Let us turn to Matthew, the ninth chapter. Last week I talked about the woman that she had it within herself. This week I'm going to talk about thou faith. Thou faith. Now I'm talking about y'all. Thou faith. Where your faith is? Amen. Is your faith... It gonna stand, or your faith gonna be where your hallelujah you find you carry your problems instead of your problems. You carry your problem on you instead of losing the problem. Let God care. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. And I thank God how the woman <laughs> react, how she react with her faith, the condition she was in, but she kept the faith. She didn't feel that she felt the condition, but she didn't let the condition overtake her. Amen. 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 Because sometimes 
our condition overtake us and we stop. Yep. But this woman didn't stop. She had to determine if I could just touch it. Amen. You know, and that's what God is looking at now through Jesus Christ. Determination that Jesus has left here on the earth. Do we have that determination that Jesus has? Amen. And that's what the Father is looking at now. Through Jesus Christ, Jesus is ready to be glorified. And the only way he's going to be glorified is through your faith. Yes, Lord. Amen. And so today, we're going to look at the verses. Amen. We're going to start at verse, hallelujah, verse 20 to 22. We're going to talk about thy faith. Hallelujah. We're talking about the woman again. Starting at verse 20. And behold, a woman which was diseased with an issue of blood 12 years. So she had the issues 12 years. How many issues y'all done had? 12 years. All right. Came behind him and touched the hem of his garment. For she said within herself, if I may touch his garment, I shall be whole. Okay, she said it within herself. If I can just touch his garment, I will be made whole. I want y'all to see something. See, the word of God is looking inside of you every day. Mm -hmm. The woman did not talk to Jesus. She didn't even get near to him. She didn't even, but Jesus knew what was in her. See, God, Jesus knows what's in each and one of us. Sometimes we ain't got to say a word, but Jesus knows you. He knows you so well. He knows what you want to say to him when you don't say it. And this is where I want y'all to realize. He picked her up without even talking to her. See, the Spirit of God picks you up. The Holy Ghost know what's going on with you. Because he said, I'll sing back the comfort what will lead and guide you into all truth. Amen. And that's why it's so very important to receive ye the Holy Ghost. So you will know him truly by the Spirit. People don't know him by the Spirit. They think they know him by the flesh. But you don't know him by the flesh. Because he, he's no more in the flesh. He is a spirit. He said, you might wish me in spirit and in truth. And when I realized how valued the Holy Ghost is, amen, then me and Jesus got something connected there. Amen. Amen. Praise God. So when he began to see her within his spirit, he didn't see her in the natural of his eye. He saw her in the spirit. Amen. He knew what was going on with her in the spirit. Is that making sense? Amen. Amen. Now, when she said that, she said, but she said within herself, if I may but touch his garment, I shall be made whole. So right there, her faith kicked in. That's what made him made a whole. That's what paid, made him pay attention to her by her faith in the spirit. Amen. So when he, when he caught the revelation of her, what did he say to her? But Jesus turned him about. And when he saw her, he said, Daughter, be of good, co be of good comfort. Thy faith hath made thee whole. And the woman was made whole from that hour. Look, Jesus, but Jesus turned himself about, and when he saw her, mm. see, he was going alone. Mm -hmm. mm. And when he caught her faith in the spirit, Mm. Is that making sense? Yes, See, Jesus paid more attention to you when you are not looking like this. Amen. He put more pay attention to you when you more walk with your head up. You're not wearing the problem, but you my God. Amen. You, you're not wearing the problem. You the problem. Oh my God. All right, all right. Woo. See, some people wear their problems. So you folks said, what's the matter? Today. Yeah. With you. So they know you win. But if you ain't win, you might have the problem, but the problem ain't win you. Amen. You still smile. Mm -hmm. You still got joy. Mm -hmm. So that's what made Jesus pay what? Attention. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you. Daughter, be a good cop. He told her, be a good cop. He was telling her, it's all right, man. Amen. Be a good cop. Die faith. Her faith had made thee whole. See you, he said, call those things, be not those they were. So start calling the chain. Do that when you start calling the chain, your faith had made you whole. 
So when you do that, it's going to soon manifest itself because he know when to manifest it. Long you stand on faith in it. Amen. Amen. God faith. Not your mama faith. Not your daddy faith. It's God faith. What you believe in? It's amazing when you come into a place, you don't check that chair out. <laughs> do you? No. You just all back to do what? Don't think nothing about it. Sometimes chill be kind of wild, but you still sick. But why we doubt our own faith? But the woman knew the condition she was in, but she said, if I could just touch it. The energy, the strength that she had, she used it to get to the source that could heal her. Amen. But us, we waste our energy Amen. and source. We call everybody instead of getting on our knees. Girlfriend, Amen. you know what's going on, girl. But girlfriend can't do nothing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. But when you go to the source, which is Jesus, then Jesus can answer the question for you right then. Amen. Amen. Oh, my God. Ooh. I hear the Holy Ghost say, Where is your faith then? Where is your faith then? Glory. And when she did that, and the woman was made whole from that power. She was free from the pain and the suffering. Ain't you ready to be free? Yes, Amen. Amen. Come on. Amen. I, I'm ready to be free. Amen. And the only way I'm going to be free is the one that freed me. That's with Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. He the only one can free you, but if you don't have faith in him, he can't free you. Amen. How much, my God. How much time do you spend in the freedom of him? Mm -hmm. See, it's something about your time. Mm -hmm. How much time do you spend with him mm -hmm. to know that you know mm -hmm. that he can free you? Mm -hmm. See, that's the question. We spend too many time <laughs> doing other things and not spending the time with him so he can what? Help us to go do it. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Just think about how much energy that took that woman to have the courage to get out there to him, to work her way through the crowd, the circumstances, to touch him. Amen. Think about how much time you spend. How much time do you spend in your faith in him? Do you give him 30 minutes? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. no. Think about it. God, I thank you. Y'all getting quiet on me. <laughs> See, time show him just how much value you love him. See, because immediately, she, he didn't go to her. Her faith went to him. Yes. Yes. Wow. See, mm. sometimes you don't have to go to him. Mm -hmm. Your faith will come to him. Uh -huh. Thank you, mm. Jesus. My God. Thank God for what? Faith. I got faith in him. Not what I can see, what I don't see. To find out what kind of thought that, that the man have in my life. Mm. Come on, sometimes you need to know how much power you have inside you. You really know how much power we have. Because we don't try it out, Mother Thomas. We don't, we, don't, we don't go beyond with Jesus. I mean, when I first got saved, boy, it was nothing. I'd be tearing, I'd be running to the church. Now, church don't, the people don't have the love for God like he used to. But this is the thing he said. He has lost the value. Who really can help me? Yeah. 
Amen. And he's trying to get you back to your rightful place in him, through your faith. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus, for faith today. Amen. Amen. All right. I'm going to show you something. Let's go to Luke, the seventh chapter. We're going to be in Luke from now on. We're going to flip. Luke, the seventh chapter. I'm going to verse 36 to 39, and I'm going to jump over to 40 to 50. I'm going to show y'all something. Mm, brother, did it give y'all safe day? Start at verse 36. And one of the Pharisees desired him that he would eat with him. And he went into the Pharisee's house and sat down to meet. Okay, he went in one of the Pharisees' house, went in there to what? To eat. Amen. See, that's a form of godliness, but denying the power. I want you to see something. In this, Jesus knows, knows you so well. He invited him in. He invited him in, but he wasn't really in. Does that make it seem? Some of y'all inviting him in, but he ain't really in. Amen. Oh, my God. That'll preach. <laughs> you invite him in, but he's not in. See, he know your emotion. He know your intent. He know all about you. Yes, he does. Amen. So look what, what, what Jesus is going to begin to say. And this head is woman. And behold, a woman in the city, which was a sinner, when she knew that Jesus said it meet in the Pharisee's house, brought in alabaster box okay. of ornament. When Jesus, when the woman knew Jesus had come into the Pharisee house, and first thing said she was a sinner, what she was, she was a prostitute. Amen, amen. amen. She was a sinner. Yes, she was. So they, she was not highly respected with the scribe and the Pharisee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. But she was a low class. Yes, she was. <laughs> but she had high esteem in Jesus. Amen. See, I want y'all, come on, y'all. I'm trying to get y'all to come on up there. See, sometimes the way you think about yourself, it ain't the way Jesus think about you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Y'all talk about all the jumped up with hey, the shout. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. you know some of these folk me and call y'all bitches. Amen. 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 No. Yeah, tell yeah, yeah, but that's true then. Y'all but like that. No, no. But Jesus didn't look at her as a bitch. All Amen. right, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Oh. Thank, Thank you. Keep it real. <laughs> Keep it real, straight up. Small tell the truth. And we feel like we one of them bitches. All right. Hey, Belma. Do you think? That's right. But it's true. To him, he talk. Now, what Jesus, what you do with that bitch? That's right. Mm. Mm. All right. The whole faith will fall more greater than his. Amen. 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 I feel the whole Holy Ghost. I'm going to go with this thing. I want you to come out. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Mm, thank Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. See, Jesus ain't looking at your character. He's looking at your faith. Thank you, Jesus. Because he's looking at my character. He will be like me and call me one of them bitches. All right. Amen. Thank Amen. you, Lord. Oh, my God. Thank you, Lord. Oh, well, y'all might not, she might not come back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Now, look, now look what, 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 what was said. What, she brought something into the house. Yes, she did. When she knew that Jesus was in the house, now the man invited Jesus in the house. That's all he did. He invited him in, but he wasn't in. Mm. Is that what you said? But when she came in, although he she was one of them bitches, mm -hmm. but she brought something Ooh. in to honor him with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. She did. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Hallelujah. All right, now look what happened. And stood at his feet behind him weeping, mm. and began to wash his feet with tears, and did wipe them with the hairs of her head, and kissed his feet, and anointed them with the ointment. Mm. 
So look what she did. She began to what? Worship him. Amen. She, she began to put her faith into what? Action. Now he invited him in, but he didn't put no action to it. See, God said, y'all coming in my house, but you ain't putting no action to it. Amen. Amen. You ain't putting no action to it. You ain't showing me how much do you love me. You're not bringing forth the gift in you that I have placed in you to show me how much you love me. Amen. Verse 39. Now, when the Pharisee which had bidden him saw it, he spake within himself, saying, This man, if he were a prophet, would have known who and what manner of woman this is that touches him. For she is a sinner. Now he that thought he up they could begin to question Jesus. Now if he knew what kind of woman this is, he didn't know Jesus. You you wouldn't have nothing to do with her. That's right. Uh -oh. That's so funny. See how he now you don't invited him in. Don't even know then you gonna is. question Jesus' character. Amen. Like if you knew what type of woman this is, you wouldn't be dealing with her. <laughs> well, why you let her in the house be? <laughs> how how people so in today's society talk people. Out of their own faith. Amen. That's true. Amen. I'm going to show you how I can explain it. You and her. If she don't know you by her way, she think about you. And she don't see you the way I see you. I can come over here and talk to her in her ear and make her change her mind how she would get you. And that's what he was doing with Jesus. Amen. Although I didn't see her like she still. Jesus did not see the woman as a bitch. He saw her faith. He saw what action she put out there in her faith. So we so concerned about how people look at us, how people think about us, but if Jesus made you and done what he's supposed to do with you, this is what you are, and you move according to your Thank you. Thank you. How many people have talked you out of some stuff that you know? Amen. <coughs> Sometimes we don't want to admit it. But you got faith in believing that I'm going to get this. And by your faith being to you, you may hope. And see, when you may hope, you may hope, but that don't mean it might not be right then, but you're going to get it because the time is season for everything. Amen. And when you get in the position of that season, it's going to come forth. Amen. See, folks going to start planting corn to the, to the springtime. Amen. Your season may be in the spring. But if I talk you out of your springtime, you, your, you ain't going to get the fullness, the wholeness, what you're supposed to get. Because I done ch told you your character is not what you say it is. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. So Jesus didn't see her the way the striving Pharisees see her. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. God. All right. I want you, and we still in there. I want you to. I want you to go to 40, jump over 44. I, I ain't going to talk about them from here. I'm going to get there talk about this woman. Amen. Go to 44 for 50. Now look what happened. And he turned to the woman and said unto Simon, Seest thou this woman? Now you, tell, now you see this woman? <laughs> All right, what did he say about her? I entered into thine house. Mm -hmm. Thou gavest me no water for my feet. Jesus, I ain't in your house. You didn't give me nothing. Come on. When we enter into God's house, see, he telling you, I'm in, when you enter into my house, I'm in it in, but you ain't gave me nothing. Mm. Mm. You ain't gave me nothing. You ain't give me no thanks. 
You ain't giving me no hallelujah. You ain't giving me no glory. You ain't giving me nothing. This way to tell me I came in, you wouldn't even watch the people. Just think about But we want Jesus to give to us. Oh, okay, look what happened. But she had washed my feet with tears and wiped them with the hairs of her head. So she gave me something personal of herself. She gave herself, she did for her tears, and I have, what you done gave? What you gave? Did you give me a thing? Did you give me a praise? See, people don't believe in giving, because you somewhere in the church or in the environment, and nobody sitting there not doing nothing. Don't you sit there and do that? If you feel a hallelujah, it's a hallelujah. Yeah. Say, I thank you, Jesus. Clap your hands. You around your people that I don't believe in. You believe you believe in Jesus Christ. Let them know. Yeah, if I know you and I see you, so hey, hey, hey I'm going to holler. I'm going to act like I don't see you walk by me. Come on. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory to God. All right, what else he said, Len? And wiped them with the hairs of her head. Thou gavest me no kiss. Didn't even kiss me. But this woman, since the time I came in, had not ceased to kiss my feet. She didn't cease from kissing me. Mm -hmm. See, you got to play. You just can't just say, thank you, Jesus. Come to church one. Amen. One time. Amen. You know, your job, how many days you work a week? Five days a week, though. Do you cease from that girl? No. Let me get me in. You don't cease from going. You sure are going. And you don't see the God, they say overtime, you get that too. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You don't cease. He said she didn't cease. She didn't stop. Look at the body. What we have done. We have stop. ceased. Amen. We have stopped. That's right. But she didn't cease from. Her. So he was telling y'all didn't do nothing yet. She didn't cease from doing what she was doing with me. And look what else he said. My head with oil. Thou didest not anoint, mm -hmm. but this woman hath anointed my feet with the ointment. Mm -hmm. Where, hold on a minute. That part right there, she was getting him ready for his burial. Mm -hmm. she, she already was getting Jesus ready for the resurrection of death. Mm -hmm. Amen. All right, come on, look what happened. 47. Wherefore I say unto thee, her sins which are many, are forgiven. See, he said, she had many sins, but it's uh, forgiven. Yes. Amen. Because of her own being. Mm -hmm. See, you got to realize this. There are no condemnation of those are in Christ Jesus. What we love in the world condemn us, and we stay in condemnation because we won't forgive ourselves. You don't do something thing you used to do, but the world said, girl, mm -hmm. you, you, you still, now for that said that used to be, girl, do you still crack that pipe? Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> See, they done spoken back on you. Yes, they do. And what you got to do is catch that guy. I, I, I used to, <laughs> but I don't do it. See, we don't want to tell about what I used to do, but I don't do it no more. Amen. All right. For she loved much. She loved, he told her. Now, he describing her. He filling her what? Within. Amen. See, he, he know how much you feel about him. Amen. You know, sometimes you want folks to prove something to you. That they love you. Bet you us women. We don't think a man loves us unless he bring us something. Amen. If he ain't bringing no flowers, Valentine's Day you get they making money. Yes, they do. 
Oh, ah, yes, we do. Y'all grinning now. Y'all pretty worried about riding the cone. <laughs> we expect them flowers. If you ain't bring no flower, you don't went to the jewelry store and picked out. I want that diamond. That diamond ring and that bracelet. I already done picked it out. I'll tell you where it is. Yeah. <laughs> We expect, then we say, ooh, he loved me. <laughs> then he get mad with you two days later. You get mad with him, then he call you one of them He don't love me. <laughs> but Jesus said she loved much. Her action of what she did, she gave up.